Mirror, mirror on the wall. Will we get into Mr. Sakaki's pants? No. Okay. Welcome back. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Uh, I would almost say. We might get we, into our pants. Yeah, though. I would say. I, I was about to say, do we, will we get into his butthole? But like, I don't think that's how this works. <laughs> this isn't dramatical murder, so. We're not a dude. Oh we don't man. Have a dick. To oh in. man. Well, if you're clit in flames a certain way. In flames. Like, like, not in flames, but like if it gets like turned on to certain... You, you know, some women have like puffy clits. I know, I'm saying if it gets... In it's fl- natural. If it get Okay, if that gets inflamed, I'm going to be really concerned for the woman because that means there's probably an infection down there. No, I'm not, I'm not talking... I'm not talking infection. I'm saying, you know, sometimes a woman gets turned on and it's like, you know, they get a little, like, clit I, I know, but you said inflamed. and so I know. I used saying. the wrong word. Okay. It's like, they, they get puffs out. Just like, oh, hey Yeah. You know, it's, it's like a third nipple. No, you know, I, I But it's like, you. there's the clit, you know. Yeah. Maybe you could stick that in his butt a little bit. <laughs> oh, my God. So let's just continue back. I, oh, I'm glad that that's the start yeah. of this episode. I really don't way. remember what happened. Uh, I edited the last okay. episode. <laughs> I forgot we named the character this I, I still forget we named that his Fish character's name is Mark, Mark Fishbach. Fishbach. Okay. Alrighty. This is the data from the analysis of the blood samples. Thank you. <laughs> I knew uh, I knew it. So it is. It's clear that the virus in these samples is the same as the virus in the other samples up until this point. I would have never guessed. None, none of us would have ever guessed. None of us would have ever guessed. None of us would have ever guessed. If the infection was originally caused by artificial means, that means this has been going on for a long time. What if the government did it? Will Rio's life be a lie? <laughs> but who would do such a thing, and why? The government. government the why government. Why have you betrayed me? <laughs> it's like, can you imagine Rio standing in front of like the fucking like a uh, House of Representatives? It's like, why have you done this to me, government? <laughs> uh, I'll leave that up to you, Rio. We have to think of a way to make an antibody as soon as possible. I agree. Ooh, my bad. <laughs> when they mention artificial means, one person... <laughs> <laughs> I was looking at that. I was looking at that. I was like... <laughs> did, 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 I... <laughs> <laughs> when, okay. when they mentioned artificial means... I'm actually five, guys. One person pooped up in the back of my mind. <laughs> he just pooped up. He just took a, took a shit all the way to the back of your mind. Oh, my God. Oh. Is it Kias? Did they pop up in your, I, up in your mind? Is it Kias? I hope so. It might have nothing to do with anything, but I should probably mention it to Rio and the others. Uh, okay. I made up my mind and started to speak. Excuse me. Yes! yes! Oh, yes! man. And this episode, wow, we're not even like three minutes in and we already like spiked the audio. <laughs> Excuse me, but isn't Kias in the same kind of position as you guys? What does that mean? Hold on. Mr. Dense government motherfucker. How do you not know what that means? Listen. I think that tie is on too tight on his neck. It's strangling his thought processes. Oh, my God. Actually, I saw him in the lab shooting zombies with a gun yesterday. Yo, remember Mr. Cool, Mr. What did you say? I know he said he worked with viruses before, but maybe he has some other special experience as well. (coughs) Like Like betraying us. Like stealing your girl? Like stealing your girl and betraying us. Vice Director, do you know anything? I can have most of the other scientists figure it out, but... The only thing I know about Kies is that he is one badass motherfucker. I mean, is that he is the Director's Secretary. Oh yeah, that's me. Come to think of it, I've never seen him for some time. I haven't seen him for some time, no. You don't think he turned into a zombie, do you? Far from it. I don't think so. If he did, we'd notice him pretty quickly, don't you think? He would be, like, the I... coolest Matrix-looking zombie I had ever seen. You know what I was going to say? How you would know? His hair. He's got some really yeah, he hair, does. Like, really cool hair. Yo, what if on cue stumbles <laughs> in zombie Kius? Uh... It's like, oh, thank God, kill it. Kill it before it spreads. Yeah, you're right. 
Maybe we should be careful around him just in case. Otherwise, he might steal all our girls. Yo, can you imagine? He breaks down the door. Boom! Sup! It's like, oh, oh, there you are. Oh, boy. He would, though. He really would, though. <laughs> uh, he's very good for a scientist, but in this kind of situation, I think it might be a good idea uh, if I focus my attention on the research part of things. Oh, that's it? We need romance XP for that. Damn. Because we talked about Kias and he pooped up in the back of my mind. Yo. I still, <coughs> I still love the idea of him just booting down the door during that situation. <laughs> uh, <coughs> I'm dying, guys. You killed me. You did. All right. We're going to go back to the story. Dude, this story. All right. Anyways, let's get Kias here. Yo, let's get the cool guy back. We can't keep subjecting the other scientists to such insta- insta- instability. Insta- thank you. Inst- to s- such instability. I agree. I was really surprised about Kias. Yeah, I was surprised too. He might have had special training, so I might just be overthinking it. I really think he caused a zombie thing. Like, I oh, really yeah, right? He did. Yeah. Maybe. Mr. Sakaki stroked his chin like he was thinking about something. I waited for what he would say next. Hey, Mark. Yes? Are you... Are you hungry? Excuse me? You can't get anything done on an empty stomach. Mr. Sakaki smiled. He took my hand and led me to the cafeteria. Because that's how you get in a girl's pants, you feed them food. Yeah, you, you wonder what you do? He's saying she's hungry, because she's hungry for that dick, dude. I was about to Damn, say. hungry for that dick. Mr. Sakaki is exactly like he was back then. He'd always somehow take away the bad feeling of the situation. I clasped his hand, and we went to the cafeteria. Let's not make it any more yeah, right. obvious that we like each other. Ten, ten minutes later, he was putting it in my butt. <laughs> Out of the frying pan into the oven. Oh. We stood in the cafeteria in front of the large refrigerator thinking for a bit. There wasn't a lot of food left. This is a really bad situation. Yeah. So why not just eat all the rest of the food? Including the canned goods, there was maybe a few weeks. No, only a few days worth of food. Oh. Oh. This isn't looking too good. Should we go down to the Islander area to get some more? No. The weekly cargo ship has stopped running. At this rate, the Islander area will have a food shortage, too. Oof. Wow, this got real. I wonder how many self-sufficient farms they have. He was right. The Islanders were all all cooped up in the school and the town hall. Rio and the others had informed us earlier. Oh, that's it? That's it? Man, oh, these chapters are, like, shorter and shorter. We leveled up and got one power for oh, that because thank God. of the food situation. Yeah, <laughs> man, man, nothing says romance like, dude, we're running out of food. food. <laughs> we're probably going to die of starvation. But at least we know we love it. But at least we can, like, you know, quench your thirst. I don't think they can really afford to try to grow their own food. Just then, Mr. Sakaki clapped his hands together like he had thought of something. That's right, the mount, <laughs> the mountain hut. <laughs> it's so random. I don't know why that's so funny. I really that's don't know. That's right, the mountain hut. <laughs> that's right, the mountain hut. That place is being used during the uh, excavation of the uh, exhydrate. Extra hydrate. Extra hydrate. <laughs> there has to be some amount of food in there. I don't. Maybe some McDonald's. Okay. Uh-oh. You want to go, let's go right away, or how far is it to the mountain hut Hold from on. Here? Let me consult the magical world of Google. Oh, are you going to look? You wanna I'm make going sure you to see. You get the right answer? Because I want to suck his dick by the end of this oh game. Oh, my God. Like, that is my goal. I so love how you're honest about this. Shall things. we date? Lost, Lost is is land. Mr. Sakaki. And now we wait for Greg to look up the Walk guy. through, shall we date? Ichiro Sakaki and spinoffs. Alrighty. <laughs> oh, I saw the image that's in the super heavy ending. Oh, really? It's cute. Oh, I've seen it too. It's really added. It's really cute. Alrighty, Mr. Sakaki. 
What chapter are we on? Chapter 8? I think so, yeah. Oh, no. we're. Oh, yeah, chapter 8. Okay, man. What? Let's go right away. You want us the answer? Let's okay. go right away. Let's go right away. Well, then, let's go. Wait. I can't take you with me. Why not? We have to go through the mountain to get there. You saw how many zombies there were. We can't say for sure there won't be more of them. There's no way I could take you in such a dangerous place. Which makes me want to go even more. I can't let you go to such a dangerous place by yourself. I looked him straight in the eyes. Just thinking about if something happened to him, I just can't bring myself to let him go alone. He stood there for a short while with his arms folded. He grumbled a little and finally let out a sigh. <sighs> Times like these, I really wish you just listened to what I say. As always, Damn. he patted my head. I Damn. looked up at him. He smiled at me. Ah, uh, whatever you do, don't leave my side, okay? Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, we better talk about it with Rio. I feel like he might ha might be against the idea, though. Well, once you tell Rio, he's gonna have to consult the government. He's gonna have to consult and the government. And then he can tell you. His and answer. then the government can tell you that it's a bad idea. It was just as the grinnings of Mr. Sakaki had predicted. We talked about it with Rio, and he was against it. No way. Lionel, you go. Okay. 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 I don't know if I was Lionel or not, but... He doesn't know where it is. If you give me a general location, I think I can get there. Yo. Yeah. It's on... <laughs> it's a mountain hut. Where is it? It's on the mountain. No, it's in the ocean. <laughs> it's on the mountain. Plus, I want you two to stay here. But... If you're not around, I don't think the other scientists will feel safe. Oh, Rio. You're the only ones who know how to use a gun. If more zombies appear... Right, you know, you can find Kias. You probably can help. Too. Yeah, right. No, no Kias won't help. <laughs> you guys need to be here to protect the, isl uh, the island. <laughs> protect the lab and other scientists. However, I can't just let a civilian go to such a dangerous place. A civilian? The other scientists are civilians, too. Either it's either our two, is it, wait, hold it. It's either our two, or a couple dozen scientists' lives. I'm sure you know which group gets priority here. The two people. Oh man! Wow, our love leader went up a lot. We sure guessed the right option, Greg. Man, wow. it's like it's like we know what we have to do to get that meter up, dude. It's like the only thing so that's So is this love meter, since it's going up a lot, is it euphemism for the penis getting hard? I say, dude, the penis is almost semi-erect. It's halfway there. Oh. Oh, here we go. Escape point, charm level, tap to continue. You need 700 charm to pass through it. Guess what? We have 1,300. Oh, God. Yeah, I think we got enough. Hi, we do have enough. The Damn. zombie was really cute, that little nurse zombie. Boop, 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 oh, look, boop. there's flowers. Oh, it's sparkly. It's show Joey now. Cleared a charm, charm level. level. <laughs> Congratulations, you've cleared the charm level checkpoint. You can now move on. Perfect. I don't like the way you're talking. I was just, imita <laughs> I was just imitating you. You have three days. You have to come back within three days. If you don't, we'll come looking for you. Understood. With that, Mr. Sakaki and I were able oh, to Oh, you got... Oh, guys. yo, you guys are all alone. <laughs> it was eerily quiet inside the mountain. I wonder if all the zombies are taken care of. I don't know how many construction workers were there to begin with, but there were a lot of them yesterday. There was something peculiar about that mountain. Something very strange. We're going to find Kius, like, fucking an indigenous person inside that mountain and be all, I have become one with the people, and I oh have God. given me powers over the oh zombies. Like, he probably is. We hurry deeper into the mountain. Oh, uh, is that a euphemism for what's about to happen? Ah! Something snagged my leg, and I stumbled. What happened? Are you okay? I tripped on something just now. Ah! I looked down at my feet to find what looked like a human hand. This is... Mark, run! It was one of the construction workers. Is what we thought instinctively. We ran as fast as we could away from that spot. It's gonna be Kias. As we looked around, we noticed hands popping up through the dirt. Off what? The what? Arr! Oh my god, it's like fucking Night of the Living Dead in this mountain. 
Night of the Living Mountain. As first, it was just their hands. Then there were arms coming up as well. If you looked closely, you could see that something had been buried in that area. Damn it. Oh, he cussed! Oh, man. It's Damn not it. serious now. Yeah, right? Damn it. There must be where the construction workers were buried. What should we do? At this rate... Ah! I felt my ankle being grabbed and looked to my feet. I saw a rotted hand grabbing my ankle. Ah! It's quite the enthusiastic ah. Uh. I grabbed a nearby branch and swung it fiercely. That, because you know, that does the fucking job. It's just swinging around. Mark! <laughs> Mr. Sagagi joined me, and we somehow managed to get the hand off my ankle. I'm supposed to be one that's grabbing you by force, not these people. But the amount of hands rising from the soil increased. Oh. There was now a sea of hands reaching out for us. You guys oh. should be happy. They're all your fans. Yo. You guys are the OTP. Mr. Sakaki, at this rate, we might... Yeah. Ooh, damn, son. It's getting good. All right. Getting away from the zombies. I'm gonna run away. Right. Mr. Sakaki, at this rate, we'll... Yeah. Mr. Sakaki's eyes shot to a nearby tree. Oh, boy. Mark, the tree. Climb up that tree. You must become one with the people. <laughs> Alright, so what do we do? Do we just accept it or do we try to fight it? I don't know. What should we Just do? accept it. Just say okay. You don't want to use a guide fish? You just want to guess? Like, okay. Yes. Okay. I put my foot on the lowest branch, lowest, lowest branch and began climbing. Mr. Sakaki was right behind me to check out that sweet ass. He was looking at my sweet ass. Mark, are you alright? Yeah, I'm actually quite good at climbing trees. You know, what can't she do, right? Man, I'm gonna climb that dude like a tree. Damn. In an effort to drown out my fear, I smiled at him. He smiled back. I like the view. I could hear that wretched moaning again. We made it by the skin of our teeth. Is it really safe right here? You're right. Go up as high as you can. <laughs> we just... We're, we're, we're three feet above. We should probably climb a little higher. I climbed as high as I could and looked down to see what was happening. Okay, real talk. Why would you climb a tree during a zombie invasion? You'd be stuck there. Um, well, there's a secret tree fort on the top of the tree. <laughs> and they just stay there? Yeah, they just fuck in the tree fort, apparently. This weighed it all out. There were already zombies wandering around the bottom of the tree. Oh, man. Huh. We tried our best not to make any noise and hid ourselves. We have to keep from being noticed. Each moan I heard made my heart beat faster. Hold on. Are we talking about the same thing now? <laughs> May. Hey, May. <laughs> Are we talking about the same thing now? <laughs> I was worried to death that the zombies would hear my pounding heart. Oh. Luckily, the zombies never looked up. Wow, these zombies are really stupid. Yeah, right? Ah! I let, I let my guard down. I accidentally yelped at a leaf that had fallen from above. Wow, Mark is fucking stupid. I tried to cover my mouth with my hand, but I was too late. Oh. A number of zombies gathered around the tree we were in, peering up at us. Damn it. We've been found. I'm sorry. It was my fault. Damn straight, bitch. I mean, no, it's not your fault. They can't get up here. That fa Wait, what? Wait, so these are like tree climbing zombies? Wow, they're screwed. What? Wow. Oh my god. They can't climb up here that fast. We might be able to shake them off if they come up. We got the right answer. Go up tree. You want to know why? Why? Because I went on Google. Oh, and I read again. <laughs> okay. Oh man. Holy this shit! This just got wild. This again. got fucking insane. Apparently, you now zombies can climb trees in this world. Okay, yeah, if that happens that in real life, insane. we're doomed, we're right? We're fucked. We are fucked. 